Senate debate drama. The top two candidates face off. We're just two weeks away from election night, and a Maryland Senate seat is up for grabs. WJZ is live at the University of Baltimore, where this debate took place. Political reporter Pat Warren has all the topics and answers from the two lead candidates. Hi, Pat. Hi, Jess. Our WJZ U.S. Senate candidates debate covered a wide range of topics from kitchen table issues like taxes to global security. Republican Kathy Shalega and Democrat Chris Van Hollen took the bull by the horns today. What can Congress do to improve the economic prospects of the middle class and the working poor? We need a simplified tax code and we need to help small business get back in the business of hiring people. So we definitely need to accelerate uh, job growth uh, in the economy. Uh, but let's remember that when President Obama was first sworn in, the economy was falling uh, through the floor. And we have had 15 million uh, jobs uh, created in this country. The candidates also fielded headlines like the Affordable Health Care Act. We know what Bill Clinton said about the Affordable Care Act. I'm agreeing with B Bill Clinton. He said, this is crazy. It would be a big mistake uh, to throw out the entire Affordable Care Act rather than uh, try and fix it. Congress has been gridlocked for years. Can you name an issue on which you believe there's an opportunity to work across the aisle? We need to invest in modernizing our roads, our bridges, our transit ways, our broadband in rural areas and inner cities. Veterans. That is where my heart is, and that is where my heart is troubled day after day. It is not a Democrat issue, and it is not a Republican issue. It is a moral imperative. Both candidates were pleased to have made their points with Maryland voters. And this is the last 12 days of a campaign, and we're working very hard. We're not taking anything for granted. But I feel very good about it. I think voters have a clear choice on November 8th. And with early voting starting tomorrow, both candidates plan to be visiting polling places. And after watching this debate, you can be sure those issues will be fresh in the minds of those early voters. I'm Pat Warren reporting live now back to you. Pat, thanks. Remember, you can catch the debate in its entirety right here on WJZ. We are sponsoring the debate along with our partners, the Baltimore Sun, the University of Baltimore, and the League of Women Voters. You can watch it tonight at 7 right here on WJZ.